you doing? Hey. It is still your favorite and best dating show. Hey. Hello, Mister. And I'm your brethren, the freshest. Yeah. In my OMG. Somebody say, oh my God. Oh my God. And of course, I'm still Ura. But before we go on with the show, we need to give a shout out to our wonderful, splendid sponsors, Noble Hair, for supplying us with amazing stylists throughout the show, keeping, you know, me and the contestants looking beautiful all day, every day. And of course, Bedmate. Okay, they're going to be giving top prizes to our couples, guys, okay? And it's going to be making their living better. Right, guys? Yeah. yeah? Okay. And court see our sponsors very, very, very shortly because we are gradually drawing to the end of this season. Some yeah. people are going to be winning prizes. Mm -hmm. Couples, audience, and what you have to do to be part of the people winning prizes is for you to determine who our top three couples are going to be. And all you have to do is vote for your own favorite by downloading the Star Times on app on your phone. Uh, so you give some couples the opportunity to win the prizes and you too, you stand a chance to win the prizes. So what are you waiting for? Yeah, what are you waiting for? Do you know, I love this part. I love Ugh. playing Cupid because I love, Ugh. you know, introducing eight lovely ladies to their Mr. Right. So on that note, Ima, and do you think today, we should bring them out? I, I think we're going to have a very good day We're going to have a hot show today. If you see what I saw at this backstage you before I came. see what he came. saw, what I saw, what he saw, what we all saw. It was hot. And she saw Lana's one. <laughs> <laughs> Without further ado, yes. how many of you would like to see what we saw? What we saw, what we saw. <laughs> With the high spirit, let us welcome our eight beautiful, hot, Woo! scintillating, Woo! amazing ladies. Welcome to the show. Thank you. Uh, Thank you. I'm going to talk to Tori. I love your name. So I know it's short for something. What is your full name? Victoria. Victoria. Nice. So wh why the Tori? Um, I just wanted to change it because I did not want it to just... Yeah, so I you felt there would be another Victoria here. So I just and you missed. Like, nice. She was right. So what do you, you know? What do you do? You know, um, I'm a model. Ooh, I could have guessed, right? She's hot. Okay. So, what is your definition of Mr. Right? I like tall guys. Okay. Really mm -hmm. tall guys. Okay. Okay. Uh, okay. I'm not so interested in their skin color. I like dark. Anything. Goes. Anything. Anything goes. But just right, be tall. Tall. tall yeah? And really handsome. And really handsome. Really, yes, really before really. the answer. Really, okay. <laughs> Sandra. Okay, Sandra, so I love your trainers, okay? I'm going to be stealing it after the show. Can, can we get a little kick? Cha! Okay, yes, I love sir. it, I love it, I love it. <laughs> so, I want to know, what is your definition of the perfect man for Sandra? Perfect man for Sandra would be a very simple but classy guy. Simple but classy. Yeah, and he has to know he wants this. Ooh, all of this, right? All of this. All of this. Okay. Mm. Who do you want to talk to? Margaret, how are you doing? I'm fine. Are you related? You guys look mm. alike. They kind of do. And all that thing. Yeah, they do. Just pretty. Ooh, girl. Okay. Thank so, you. Uh, just to be sure, because it don't be like, say, we are doing Miss World here today. We are so Telling you. What are you here for? First? Oh, God. What are, we, what are you here for? I'm here to find my Mr. Right. Oh, wow. So, what does he have to be? What, what does it take to be your Mr. Right? Um, physically, he has to be tall because I'm obviously not short. Yeah. So, True. and I need to feel secure with him. That's all. Good and point. I'm into dark guys. So. Dark Ooh, guys. Dark chocolate, right? Mm. Yes, I like that. I like that. Precious. They look so precious. <laughs> That's right. Precious more than the silver. Um, the pearl. pearl yeah, sure, precious. <laughs> <laughs> so how are you doing? How are you doing? I'm fine. You're fine? She You're here what? to find your Mr. Right too, yeah? Yes. So what are you looking for? The tall guy. Just the tall okay. guy? Yes. The tall guy. Not too pretty. I don't do pretty boys. <laughs> Why? Pretty Why? Boys. What's wrong with pretty boys? Are you kind of intimidated by pretty boys? Yes. Well, you're pretty, but you're, well, you're pretty, pretty too. I know, but I don't do them. You can have pretty babies hey. together. I know. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Senior blessing. <laughs> you must seriously. Uh oh. You are That's the senior in this nice. class. Because uh, you are repeating this class. <laughs> 
day. We'll be trying. But... Do you think today will be the day? Ah, hopefully. I hope so. We hope so. We all hope so. For all right. You. Okay. So, ladies, you ready? Very yeah. Because I've got a feeling I can smell a bit of masculine perfume in the air. Mm. And that tells me that Mr. Wright is here. So, mm. I have to do the deed and summon Mr. Wright onto this stage right now. Okay, so let's do it. Right. Mr. Wright! You. Very well, cool. I love your blazer, Mr. What That's is your name? Blazer. My name is Kenneth. Hey, Kenneth. So look around you. Do you like what you see? Do you like what you see? Indescribable. <laughs> oh, I walk with that. Indescribable. Okay. So I need to know something, Kenneth. Okay, before we go, because you know I love fashion and I love the way you look today. And one of my favorite colors, okay, it's green. Okay. Wow. Yes, because it always reminds me to eat healthy because I don't eat healthy. So when I see green, I remember you know you have to eat more salad. Okay. So. <laughs> What inspired your look today? Uh, actually, I, I deliberately wore the olive green because it, it, uh, the meaning of the, what it represents is calmness. Yes. And, uh, healthy, healthy, healthy man. Healthy, healthy man. And also, I just wanted to look myself. Okay. Calm and sweet. Okay, so on that note of being calm, Kenneth, I want you to look at all these beautiful ladies, yeah? And I want you to let me know who your dream girl is. But, but, you can only whisper in my ear and make sure Ima doesn't hear, because I don't know why he's body to body. What's going to happen here? Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, Kenneth, so look around, look around. Don't mind him, don't worry. People remember Ijoshi, you know, like, <laughs> we are talking now. <laughs> you said, we are tell her. <laughs> okay, so look around you. Okay. Ah, my brother is you right, dream girl now? right now. Of course, okay. So whisper to me, whisper to me, Kenneth. So these people are dream looking, girl. They are looking camicious. Kami, kami, kami. Okay. <laughs> All right. I know a secret that you don't know, Ima. How do you feel? Leave me alone. I have left you. Alone. I've left you. We're, we're, we're in stage one. Please we are, we are, we are. We are on stage one. This is one. just simply love at first sight. You don't know anything about him yet. Uh, All that doesn't matter right now is just his looks. So if it's your kind of guy, mm -hmm. from the look mm -hmm. you see, mm -hmm. please leave your hats on red. If not, at the count of three, turn is on black. black. So what is your um, decision going to be? Are we ready, ladies and gentlemen? Let's go yeah. together. One, two, three. What happened? What happened? Can I see? Oh. Okay. Blessing. I'm actually shocked. Make some noise for blessing, ladies and gentlemen. Bad news and good news. It's yeah. good to hear the bad news first before you hear the good news. Definitely. Yeah, hear me, Helen? Mm -hmm. Why me? <laughs> Why is your heart on black? Because um, <laughs> it doesn't seem confident and outspoken. It's okay. Basically. Margaret, why is your heart on black? It's not just my type. Hmm. Sandra, why is your heart on black? For guys who wear socks. <laughs> okay. Wow. So you're that deep. Hey, why are you here? Oh no, Shannon, we just. Victoria. Why is your heart on black? It's too soft. I, I don't think it's going to be crazy. Okay. Oh. I'm so sorry. We made a mistake. What? Who is your Mr. Rice? What are you looking for, in Mr. Rice? <laughs> crazy, Teddy G. <laughs> There's a way a guy would talk, you know, you know this guy, you know, was, uh, I think okay. he's too soft. Yeah, I am a little, I don't know much, he's like the one that know much. A little roughness, a little roughness. Mm -hmm. oh, yeah, a little, yeah. Okay. Sorry, what's the problem? Why? Okay. Uh, I don't, I don't feel like the color suits him. And but it's he's healthy. So he's healthy. He's huh? trying to tell you that we're going oh. to be healthy together. Uh, you I don't, don't get like it. Okay. Okay. Right. Kalista says, Kalista. <laughs> yeah. Why? I don't do skinny guys because I'm skinny, so I don't like him. He's you not skinny. So you like, for me. you like matter. Okay. Anything that has weight and occupies space. Not really occupies space. I don't like skinny guys. Don't like, skinny but you can feed him. I don't like him. He's I don't like his self. Esteem is not uh -uh. Okay, um, precious. What is the problem? He's not my kind of guy, and he looks too serene. He looks too serene. <laughs> so you would have preferred if he looks bad. <laughs> good, I know. Like if he just enters in. I'm not sure. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Good news, finally. Somebody said good news, finally. Hi, <laughs> 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 
blessing. Oh, blessing. What happened? Oh my God. Oh. Okay. Um. <laughs> now, like you said, this is the first stage. I love what he's wearing. Yeah, me like, too. It looks sharp. Mm. I just love it. Yeah, yeah. Ladies, you said what you need to say. Mm -hmm. So, Mr. Wright, I think it's only fair we get to know you a little bit better, right? Because they, they, okay. they're already judging you. They don't even know who you are. They're already judging you. So let's you. see so who you are. Let's take a look profile. at your profile, yeah? My name is Kenneth Opo. I'm from Nigeria, from the Elsa State, residing in Lagos. I'm 34. I'm a media consultant, also a major in modeling, commercials, and also my hobbies are love singing, writing, and I'm also a creative director. Uh, I think I had a good relationship back then, but due to distance, she wasn't in the country. She's far in the U.S., so we couldn't really communicate with each other more often than than we we stop communicating and we know more. I'm looking for a lady that has a great potential, supportive, prayerful, beautiful. And also God-fearing. Actually, I'm selective. I have the kind of people I like. I love a lady who has a, a perfect body, but also a great mindset, and also someone who is ready to work as a team together with. That, I mean, I heard everything you said, which was amazing about you dating somebody and they moved to America and so on. But the one that kind of caught my ear is you want the lady with a perfect body. So what is your definition of perfect body? Good question. Uh, yeah. Someone who is shapey as in the eight, you know. Figure eight. Like, you know, the Coca-Cola. Coca-Cola, um, okay. Anyways, blessing, based, on, based on what you're seeing right now, are we proceeding? Or are you coming down from this bus? Mm, I'm actually coming down. Oh. Sorry. Um, wow. Why? You let me count one, two, three. <laughs> Listen, why? What happened? Like I said, um, he said he actually wants a lady with uh, the compact. He used the word compact, right? Compact body. And uh, I don't think I'm that lady. Okay, but no, that's you why. can squat a little bit in the gym. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Anyways, okay, right. all hope is not lost. You can still live here with your dream girl. Yes, you can. You can persuade her after we find out. But I think you should show us your talent first because I don't think they know you. So what are you going to be doing today? What is your talent? I'm going to be singing. I just want my dream girl. Hmm. Someone who satisfy me in everything I need. Baby, Ooh. come down to me. Ooh. And we gonna make a happy family. Mm. I just need my dream girl. Uh. Wow, Kenneth, okay, well done, well done on that. Uh. So I feel to get his dream girl. I think Margaret is a dream girl oh, because why? I don't know their heights suit each other. Okay. I think his dream girl is Margaret. Margaret. Oh, wow. Because why? Margaret is the girl that has an in my frame. Margaret is the girl that was. Yeah, I, I think it's uh, Tori. Tori. Okay, yeah, why? because. Uh, they, they stare at each other. <laughs> Is that okay for you? Yes, sir! <laughs> artist, artist. <laughs> okay, his dream girl is the one and the only Margaret. Oh. Yes! Margaret! How do you feel? You're his dream girl. Oh, I'm surprised. Okay. I don't, I'm not built like a Coke bottle, so I'm wondering. <laughs> well, maybe you're his definition of Coke bottle. Yeah. Because yeah. his Coke bottle is his Coke bottle. Yes. You can't drive it. You can't. So, my brother, I have good news for you. Mm -hmm. But it is in your hands. You have the opportunity to still take Margaret out of here, but you have to convince her because she has a right to her opinion. So, do you think you can? Get her to change her mind. Oh. If you think so, please give it a try. Then we ask her one more time. Yeah. If she's gonna go with you or not. Uh, yeah. Like I said, when I entered, there's no word to describe anybody, but you know, oh 
I thought of every good word to describe you. Still, there are no good words. I still look for the best words. Still, there are no best words. Oh, <laughs> What is just out of place? Hey. But you are replacing Hi. that better word. Oh. Hi. So, Margaret, would you be my dream girl? So right now, you have the right I to have either change again. your mind and make him your Mr. Right or still stand on your lane and be like, oh, bro, regret. <sighs> what is it going to be? At the count of three. One, two, three. behind the number. Oh, you can't judge. A lot, a lot of you will be saying crazy, crazy, crazy. You can't, appear, you can't jam someone who is crazy and even if I'm dressed like this. We're all crazy inside except okay. you're looking for a madman. <laughs> yeah. When you meet a madman on the first day, you know he's a mad person. We are here yeah. for something and I came to pick, uh, pick my meteorite or whatever. I, that's why I'm dressed like that. I won't be coming uh, like a mad person on the stage to pick Miss Wright. No, no, you don't expect me to come like Wait, a mad I person. No, no, no. I have good news for you. Yes. Even if these ones are not, they are not, it's their loss. Mm -hmm. Somebody might be watching you at home right now. Right there. I even feel there are some ladies that are tripping for you in the audience. Right there. So has this affected your confidence in any way? Never, no, brother. never. So keep it up, never, keep it up. Ladies never, and gentlemen, never. make some noise for our almost Mr. Rack. Kenneth! Well done, Kenneth. Thank you. And I feel normal. I don't feel anything. I'm, no, I'm not their choice, so. And they're wearing my choice, too, even if I had one person. But it didn't just work. But doesn't mean it won't work out there for me.